Well, we wanted to do a little informational video about our Alcourt Sailfish 14 Deluxe. That's what this boat would have been called back around 1952, 53-ish when it was uh, built. They hadn't come up with the term super sailfish yet. So this is the 13 foot, nine inch boat that has the uh, same size rig as the uh, sunfish, which hadn't been uh, invented yet. So they had a 12 footer and a 14 footer. So they had a sailfish 12, a sailfish 14. This is the 14, then they decided to make it deluxe by adding a few features to it, which we found have come in pretty handy. Uh, one of the features is the, it's got both a, a tow rail and a rub rail on the side. And we found, uh, found out that little rub rail gives you a good spot to um, grab on with the hand if you're trying to get back on the boat. And also the, uh, the tow rail is a good place to kick your heel against to keep you from sliding off the boat. So the way this boat was built is one of the things you want to do if you're going to add something like this to your uh, wooden sailfish, this is a wooden boat, is make sure you got areas where the water can drain off. So they've got little, I'll just call them limber holes for lack of a better, they've got little drain areas where the water can get off the boat. So if you do get capsized or other stuff on there then that water can find a way. You want to leave a little channel over here so water doesn't get trapped around the handrails. So we got uh, rub rails and tow rails and handrails. The other deluxe feature was this little combing. And at first I thought, why well, that combing, that's kind of goofy. You know, you're going to get wet, so what's it matter? Well, that keeps, that means it keeps you basically getting splashed versus getting washed off the boat because these boats uh, they do uh, they do like to submarine that's part of the fun so we got this big wave coming back towards you it's gonna get uh, it's gonna get diverted so that you don't lose your grip on the boat get swept off the other place they put a little drain for the deck is up here by the bow handle so that water can get off there. Uh, speaking of drains, this boat has a couple of drains. Let me see which size it's on, side it's on. One of them is up by the bow. And the other one was aft, so I, I don't I don't know when that drain up at the bow would be most handy. But the one aft is the one we use the most if we get any kind of water in there. And it's put up towards the top, and I think the idea is you flip the boat over, put the bow up, and you got the flat deck. So that's the best spot for the water to drain out there. So that's some of the information about the Alcourt Sailfish 14 Deluxe. There was a uh, name change today. Uh, a uh, rechristening. This was a Zsa Zsa, so we took her out, washed the, uh, took her backwards, washed the old name off the transom, and uh, rechristened her. Some water splashed on the bow with her new name, and her new name is Tracker. <laughs>